What's up everyone, David here. Today's video is diving into passing and shooting. We see quite a few athletes struggle with this, so today we're gonna talk uh, through a few different techniques, as well as a progressive uh, training plan that you can follow. And our goal here is more fluidity and consistency when under pressure. We'll start with your primary or foundational pass. For this, you're gonna want your finger either on the blade or on the very uh, back of the torpedo. And then you kind of throw it uh, like you would a dart. So mainly wrist action uh, and very smooth and controlled. The finger placement really comes down to personal preference, but this is the technique that you'll be using 80% of the time. Uh, the next techniques really come into play uh, during you know tight scraps, other situations where you might not be able to get a, a solid uh, hold of the torpedo, or you might not even have your dominant hand available. The first of these is the dart method, which is just kind of holding it like a dart. I have found that holding it behind the center of mass makes the torpedo really hard to control. So you do want to grip in front of that center of mass. And the final technique is this kind of guiding technique, which I've been seeing pop up more and more uh, on shots. And I've actually found that it's really easy to be accurate and control the torpedo. It'll be a bit slow though. When it comes to training, just remember that this is a fine motor movement, um, so you're going to want to get as many reps as possible in a low stress environment. For this, the shallow end works fine, and just find some sort of target to, uh, to bust out um, some reps in the different techniques and configurations we discussed. It should only take one or two training sessions before you're pretty competent in, in all the techniques. Um, and then you'll want to layer on uh, some additional complexity, changing your perspective, maybe get a group of friends together and practice leading the pass. Uh, normal uh, deep end fitness sessions are great for this. And then, uh, you know, we'll see you, uh, we'll see you at 14 feet. <laughs>